The Adventures of Ned Ned was a sheet ghost who loved fishing. He had a hat that he always wore when he went fishing. He liked to fish in Lake Tahoe, where the water was clear and blue. One day, Ned decided to go fishing in the lake. He looked for some worms to use as bait, but he couldn't find any. He searched high and low, but there were no worms anywhere. He wondered if someone had taken them all. He decided to go to the lake anyway, hoping to find some worms there. He grabbed his fishing rod and his hat and headed to the lake. He saw a boat near the shore and decided to use it. He didn't think anyone would mind. He got on the boat and started rowing. He enjoyed the breeze and the view of the lake. He saw some birds flying in the sky and some fish swimming in the water. He felt happy and relaxed. He rowed until he reached a place where he saw a big house on the shore. It looked like a castle from a fairy tale. He wondered who lived there. He decided to get closer and take a look. He got off the boat and walked towards the house. He saw a sign that said Vikings home. He thought that was a strange name for a house. He wondered if it had something to do with Vikings. He walked around the house and saw a stone observation area. It looked like a nice place to sit and enjoy the view of the lake. He decided to go there and see if he could find some worms. He climbed up the stone steps and reached the observation area. He looked around and saw some flowers and plants. He hoped there were some worms under them. He started digging with his hands, looking for worms. He didn't notice that someone was watching him from behind. It was a woman who lived in the house. She was surprised to see a sheet ghost digging in her garden. She wondered what he was doing there. She decided to talk to him and find out. Excuse me, what are you doing here? She asked. Ned heard her voice and turned around. He saw a woman standing behind him. She looked friendly and curious. He smiled and said, Hello, I'm Ned. I'm looking for some worms. Worms? Why do you need worms? She asked. I need them for fishing. I love fishing in the lake, he said. Fishing? But you're a ghost. How can you fish? She asked. I can fish just fine. I have a fishing rod and a hat, he said. He pointed to his fishing rod that he had left on the boat. She looked at it and nodded. I see. Well, I'm sorry to tell you, but you won't find any worms here, she said. No worms? Why not? He asked. Because this is my garden, and I don't like worms in my garden, she said. She pointed to a sign that said no worms allowed. Ned looked at it and felt disappointed. Oh, I'm sorry. I didn't see your sign, he said. That's okay. I don't mind you being here, as long as you don't dig up my plants, she said. She smiled and said, my name is Elsa, by the way. Nice to meet you, Elsa, he said. They shook hands and became friends. They started talking about themselves and their interests. They found out that they had a lot in common. They both liked nature and animals. They both liked stories and music. They both liked adventure and fun. They decided to spend some time together and have some fun. They went back to the boat and rowed around the lake. They saw some beautiful sights and heard some lovely sounds. They went back to the house and explored it together. They saw some interesting things and learned some new facts. They went back to the observation area and watched the sunset together. They saw some amazing colors and felt some warm feelings. They had a wonderful time together and became good friends.